Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to talk to you about how a computer calculates numbers. Now the very first thing that you need to note when you're talking about how computers calculate numbers is that a computer only ever sees short bursts of 5 watts of electricity. That's all they ever see. Uh, for every single operation that they're doing, they, they don't understand the data that they're working with. All they know is, is there electricity here or is there not electricity here? And uh, that is represented in computers by a process called binary code. Let's go to our computer. And here I have a little, uh, little short list here of some binary codes. Now, what binary does is basically a numbering system. Now, I'll highlight the binary section here to where you either have a 1 or a 0. Now, a 1 represents uh, a burst of electricity, and a 0 means there's no burst of electricity. So if you're calculating a number one, you get a burst right here at the very beginning and no other electricity past that. The computer will interpret that as being a one. And now if you get a burst of electricity on the second bit here, the computer will uh, interpret that as being a two and so on. Now it adds those together. Basically your first row here, uh, instead of being tens based, is based on two. Your first row is one, your second row is two, your third row is four, and your fourth row is eight. That continues on basically multiplying by two to where you get 16, 32, 64, and 128. And the computer adds all those numbers together and it'll come up with the result. For instance, for seven, you have a bit in the one, that would be one. You have a bit in the two, that would be two. And you have a bit in the four. So that would basically amount to four plus two plus one, which is equal to seven. That's basically how a computer will uh, calculate these numbers. As you can see for the number 8, uh, it has a single burst of electricity in the 8's column and none others. So that computer knows that that is an 8. If I had this number right here with an 8 and then a 1, that would be the number 9. So basically a computer will compare these numbers, uh, see what it has, when it got electricity and when it did not get electricity, and it will know what number it is currently calculating. My name is Dave Andrews and I've just told you how computers compute numbers.